So this is the Olympus Fan 82, so it just arrived like this one. I think let's say if you have the budget like just uh plus the three gila. This one is a better option because um the ISO it can goes up to 400 and also you don't actually have to change the focus which is um something quite hard to learn as well like, at first and so I would say this one is a better option like, and also the condition is quite nice as well. Okay, and also the let's say if you want to use a flash, it's actually quite easy for this unit because you can directly put the flash on this hot shoe right here. So yeah. Okay, so I'm going to show the oral condition and also how it works down this camera. So first thing first is checking the shutter. So the shutter is still working as well. And also and change the aperture. It changes as well. Okay. And then right here. This is the back of the camera. You can see the shutter opens as well. Right now I'm going to insert the film. So just slide the film inside one of the states right here. Okay, and then hold it like this. And this thing push it up. Right here. Push it down. Okay, wind it. Okay, when you see that it winds successfully already, just go ahead and close it. And this one tells you um what shot la. Okay, so when it shows number one means that you're already to go la. So just you can just start to shoot already. Okay. And also la, this thing it changes according to the film. La. Let's say you put a ISO 400 film, you put ISO 400 la. 200, you put ISO 200 la. Same thing as well. And I'll show you the viewfinder as well. So this is what we just see from the viewfinder. Okay, so let's say um, when it's in dark situations, you can see that there will be a red flag it pops up when it's, at, uh, it's in the light situation. And then like when there's enough light source, you can just press the shutter. So it's actually uh, quite easy and convenient to use camera, I would say. Okay, and then to use this camera, it's just very easy. Like, actually, just shoot until finish already. And after, just um, rewind it. And this one is for you to change the aperture. Let's say you have a flash right here. It will tell you like what distance you have to put what aperture as well. Okay, let's say if you want to rewind it after you should have done 72 already. Just press this button right here. So there's a button right here. And this thing put it out like this. Then following the arrow, just wind it. Okay. And then you wind until you cannot feel the resistance anymore. Just go ahead and open it back and take the thing out. So yeah, basically that's it. Very easy to use camera, I would say.